What's up watch bros, Connor here. Another quick little video for you. Today I'm gonna do my top five favorite Casios for under 50 bucks. Uh, the reason why I wanted to make this video is I was on Amazon the other day just looking around and well, actually I was going through my collection and I was just amazed at how many Casios I actually have. Usually I just pick them up on a whim. I mean honestly, usually at Walmart you know, say I forgot a watch to work that day. Maybe I'll swing by Walmart, just pick one up, why not? They're so cheap. But yeah, so, I mean, I wanted to make this video for the guy that's out there on a budget. You don't have a lot to spend. Maybe you just want something to beat up for work. Um, or maybe you're in college, you know, you don't got a lot of extra, extra cheddar. You're balling on a budget. So you just need something to get you by. Uh, honestly, great place to look is Casio because it's amazing what you get for your money, all the functions you get for your money. You know, if you want to buy a movement watch, you're going to pay a lot more for something that's cheaply made, overpriced, and they're just simple analog display watches when you can go to a Casio and get a lot of functions. Whatever, I'm rambling, let's just get into the video. Alrighty, so before I get into the video, I figured I'd give you a quick uh, wristwatch check just to show you what I'm wearing today. Kind of ironic compared to what I'm about to talk about, but today I am wearing my favorite watch. If this will focus. Come on. Yeah, so I'm wearing my Datejust today. Uh, yeah, it's <laughs> a little bit out of our $50 budget today, but that's what I'm wearing. So without further ado, let's get into the video. Alrighty, so the first watch we're gonna have up is the Casio MRW 200H. And one thing you're gonna learn from this list is Casio gives their watches terrible names. <laughs> they are all numbers and nobody can remember them. But anyways, here you go. So the Casio MRW 200H is this guy right here. Let's see if we can get a focus. Alrighty, so there it is. This is the Casio MRW200H. It's a resin watch, like most Casios are gonna be. Super durable, plastic case. Uh, price on this guy is about 15 bucks. Uh, somewhere in that range. A ton of different colors, options. <clears throat> There's white bodies, the black ones. My favorite one is black with white numbers and a red pip at the top. Uh, but yeah, super durable watch, 100 meters of water resistance. You can go, you know, feel free to go in the water with this guy. Uh, it'll take a beating. It's an awesome work watch. It's not exactly the best looking watch out there. So this one would definitely lean more towards the sporty side. Uh, but you could wear it casually if you want to. That's up to you. Uh, I do like the analog display. So this is one of the few that I'm going to talk about today that are analog display. Uh, not digital, uh, but yeah, just a great cheap watch, um, workhorse beater, you know, if it breaks, who cares, grab another one for 15 bucks, uh, but yeah, day date, don't know if I mentioned that already, uh, but yeah, that's the Casio MRW200H, and again, only about 15 bucks. Alrighty, so the next one up is, it's kind of two watches technically, but they're basically the same watch. Uh, so we have the Casio F91W, let's focus there, yeah, so the Casio F91W, it's a classic, you know, I'm sure you've seen the all black version of this, <clears throat> I like this one, it's got the resin case, but it's kind of painted to almost look like stainless steel, it is not stainless steel, it's plastic, uh, they make, so they make the silver one, the all black, and then there's a gold one too, that looks pretty cool if you're balling on a budget this is a great watch for a student uh let's get into pricing so pricing on this varies from 11 to 14 dollars so again super cheap um 35 millimeters uh alarm day date i think the water resistance is about 50 meters but yeah so this is the f91w but as I said, it's kind of two watches I'm suggesting here. So the other one is going to be, so this is the other one. This is the Casio A158WA. Again, great names, Casio. Super easy to remember. <laughs> 
But yeah, same specs, same size. Uh, again, that 11 to $14 price range. This one has a stainless steel bracelet. It's super cheap, super flimsy. But what are you going to complain about for 11 bucks, 14 bucks, whatever? <laughs> but yeah, this would probably be my preferred one just because it's cooler to have it on the metal. Uh, but you could go either way with these. Uh, so yeah, that's the Casio F91W and A158WA. Um, so yeah, 35 millimeters, alarm, day date, and about 50 meters of water resistance on these, I believe. Alrighty, so number three is going to be this guy here. Let's focus, let's focus. Alrighty, so this is the Casio AE1200WHD. As you can see, this is a world time watch. Yeah, world time watches for under 50 bucks. Matter of fact, under 25. This one comes in at about 22.39 is the price on Amazon right now. So yeah, this is a world time watch as you can see. That's over here. You can select your different time zones. It's a five alarm watch right there. Obviously digital display down here with the time. And then there's also uh, alarm, I believe chronograph, and obviously the world time function there. So this one comes on the stainless steel strap. It's uh, like the last one I showed you with the stainless strap. They are super cheap and flimsy but you can get it in some different colors and on different uh, strap options. I prefer this guy on these straps here. I got a little DIY with it. I took a strap off of another Casio, the white one here, and then mixed it with the black from another Casio as well. Uh, but yeah, I think it adds kind of a cool look to it, that two-tone. But yeah, so case size on this guy is about 39 millimeters, I believe. Uh, it's a great size, in my opinion, compared to the last ones. Those are on the small side, uh, but this is a much more wearable size for me. I have about a seven and a quarter inch wrist to a seven and a half, I can't remember. Um, but yeah, and then a hundred meters of water resistance on this guy, so super durable. Go ahead and take this one swimming as well. So that is the Casio AE1200WHD. It's the Casio World Time. Let's just call it that. Alrighty, so the next watch I'm gonna talk about, I don't actually have it in the collection anymore, but I have owned it in the past. Uh, that's gonna be the Casio MDV 106, AKA the Casio Duro. Uh, so this guy is gonna come in at roughly about 42 bucks on Amazon right now. It's got a 44 millimeter case. That's a stainless steel case um, with an aluminum bezel insert. As you can see, if I've thrown in the picture of mine, I ghosted mine out just to give it a cool kind of vintage look to it. So like I said, stainless steel case. One thing to be aware of on Amazon is I think the most popular selling one says it has a 20 millimeter lug width. It's actually a 22 from what I remember when I owned it. So yeah, analog display, as you can see, much more, you know, similar to a normal watch that I would have in my collection. I'm not a big digital watch guy, so I do prefer most of my watches like this. But when it comes to the cheaper watches, you do get more for your money when it comes to functions in digital. But if you're looking for a true analog watch, this is the best Casio under 50 bucks. So yeah, analog display with the date there. Uh, Japanese quartz movement and 200 meters of water resistance. So this is the first true dive watch on this list so far. So yeah, that is the Casio MDV 106, AKA the Casio Duro, a much better name for it. Casio, go ahead and just change it to the Duro, make it easier for us. Alrighty, so here we are down to the number one, in my opinion, Casio watch under 50 bucks. And that's going to be this guy here. If we can get it to focus. Yep, there we are. So this is the classic, the Casio G-Shock DW5600E. So this is basically the OG G-Shock, <laughs> so to speak. 
Uh, it's not the true original. The original has the brick around here, if you remember. This is just kind of a blacked out uh, around the dial there. Uh, but yeah, I mean, the silhouette is the classic G-Shock G shape. My favorite G-Shock shape, in, in my opinion. <laughs> I'm not a huge fan of the kind of rounded, sharper ones or almost oct octagonal G-Shock case. Uh, but yeah, this guy is coming in at about 40 bucks right now on Amazon. 45 millimeter case, wears super comfortable, looks good on almost all wrists. Um, digital display with day, date, month, alarm, and chronograph. So packed full of features here for the money. And again, like the Casio Duro, this one has 200 meters of water resistance, so you know it's built tough. That resin case can take any beating you throw at it. Super tough watch to break. This is my favorite, my go-to work watch. I wear this thing all the time, whether I'm working out or I'm gonna beat it up, out in the, working in the yard, doing whatever. Swimming in the ocean, go for it. This is, I think, one of the toughest watches out there, and it's coming in under 50 bucks. So yeah, that is the number one watch made by Casio, under 50 bucks. Alrighty, so there you have it. There are my top five favorite Casios under 50 bucks. That's the list, guys. Tell me what you think. Tell me if I missed any. Uh, but that's what I got for you today. So thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.